You should immediately notice the difference in Coach Lee's follow through on this stroke compared to the last. The emphasis here is on putting very high speed on the ball with just enough topspin to bring it down on the opponent's side of the table. Thus, the follow through of the stroke is primarily forward. Aside from the follow through, the backhand fast loop stroke follows all the same fundamentals as the slow loop. Begin in the ready position with your body square to the table. Ensure the weight is evenly distributed on the balls of your feet and that they're slightly wider than shoulder width. Start the backswing by bending your knees and slightly rotating your waist to the left while bringing your right shoulder forward and down. At the peak of your backswing, your upper body should be leaning forward with knees bent, halfway to a sitting position with most of your weight on your left foot. Keep your head up looking forward. Your racket should be just below waist level with your right shoulder ahead of your left. Initiate the forward swing by pushing upward with your legs and rising up out of the crouch position. Watch how Coach Lee's wrist cocks back as his elbow and forearm initiates the movement of his racket. The result is a whip-like motion that snaps through the ball and creates the lethal speed and topspin of the fast loop. As your legs and waist straighten, follow through with your racket to the right of your head. Your goal is to have a primarily forward follow through. Use your legs, waist, arm and wrist in one fluid motion. The goal is to use your entire body in unison.